Hello, guys. How's it going? Oh, it's I'm been right. a while. Yeah, it has been a while since last time. Yeah, what happened? It's a long story, but the stove broke down. You get a so new get one, a right? New one. Yeah. And, Great. And uh, winter happened. Winter. Yeah. Epic coldness. Yes. Epic darkness. Yes. So what we eating tonight? Tonight we're gonna eat some delicious food. We had a spring chicken from France. Yeah. Yeah, from France. It's a quite small chicken. Yeah. You can see. Uh, we're gonna stuff it with some apple, onions, and the butter with estragon in it. Nice. And what's that? The hazelnut. Hazelnut. Nice. We're gonna use it as a garniture mm -hmm. later. Cool. Yeah. Are we having anything else to this? Yes, we're gonna do a gris of the curly flour. Okay. Nice. So you've been boiling this, guys, right? Yeah, this has been boiling for a while. It's soft, but not mega soft. Yeah. And uh, after that, it goes in the oven, right? Kinda. No. No. Not this one. This is for oh, the, the puree. puree. Okay. Nice. I got another half in the oven. Yep. So we're gonna mix the puree with some. Uh, color flour from that. Nice. Right, we're so we're gonna make a sauce with some fried butter and a little bit of uh, soy sauce, soy sauce, sake, marine. Oh, nice. And also, it's gonna be some ginger in it. Ginger. Sounds delicious. Let's get busy, right? Yeah. So sure. let's let's start with some chicken, right? Yeah, we're gonna stuff these small chickens. I'm gonna put some apple in it and a little bit of onion, and then. Some of the butter. All right. I said, so, uh, start with one. Yeah, just go. Yeah. Yeah. I just need one. Got some chives here as well. Let's Let me, start let me move with it. a piece of butter. Mm -hmm. Generous piece, yeah. And just put it straight in. Mm -hmm. A few pieces of onion. A few pieces of apple. You have to push it in. You want to stuff it <coughs> very well. Yeah. Sounds okay. good. So you're gonna, you're gonna, gonna make, seal it, or you're gonna wrap it up, or I'm gonna wrap it up with some some thread. Yeah, yeah some yeah. thread here. Nice. And uh, yeah, you will see later here. Mm -hmm. I will. I'm just gonna stuff this. Yeah, down. let's go for it. Zoom in on the butter. Mm. Onions, apple peeled, yeah. hazelnuts, but that's for later's. So now this is stuffed. Mm -hmm. You can see. We're gonna tie it up. Like nice. This. Yeah, you take the legs yeah. and the wings. Tie them up. Let me go over here. Do something like this. This is the hardest part. To make the knot. Yeah, <laughs> make the knot. Yeah. Round one leg, I guess. Yeah. You might lift them up a bit. You want to seal this so it mm -hmm. doesn't get out when mm -hmm. you cook them. I'll go above here. See. Ah, it's not a pretty process. No, but it's must be done. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, so, um, so it's chicken are from France, right? Yeah. We got them today. It looks mm -hmm. pretty nice. Smaller. We were looking for quail, actually. Yeah. It's not but a quail they... season. No, they didn't have fresh ones, no. just frozen ones. So we don't do fro frozen. No. no, not today. Not today. Something like that. I can put it up here. I can hold it. Yeah. Nice. Can turn it. See. Nice. It's pretty cool. All right. So let's. Now we're gonna do all of them. Yep. And then we're gonna put them in the oven. Yeah. For about thirty-five minutes, okay. one hundred and seven degrees. Nice. All right. Let's let's get busy. Yeah. So. Uh, Nice work, man. Yes. Yeah. They're all. Um, They're all not string. Up. Yeah, not up. String. So now we're gonna brush them mm -hmm. with some melted butter. Yeah. Melted butter, mm -hmm. and I'm just gonna add some drops of soy. Nice. For the saltiness, right? Yeah. yeah. Also, a little bit of <coughs> salt in the butter, perhaps. Yeah. 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 Coat them well. It's a pretty fast dish to make, right? Yeah. A little bit of prep, or you have to cut the, the apple, the onions, stuff like that. Doesn't take a long time. No. 
Well, I would say butter is a key ingredient, right? Definitely. Since you're making the dragoon. Yes. Butter has stuffing. So. Yeah. On all sides or just on top or? Just on top. Yeah. So what are we doing with these guys now? Pre fry them or pepper? Yeah. Salt and pepper, and then we're gonna put them in the oven. Mm -hmm. Make the skin crisp, yeah? Yeah. Nice. Cool. Like that? So, let's put them in the oven. Yeah. And, uh, let's see, how many degrees? 170. Mm -hmm. For about 35, 40 minutes. All right. They should have an inner temperature mm -hmm. of about... Uh, 70, 72 degrees Celsius. Yeah. All right, let's get on to the next stuff, right? Yeah. Yeah, man. So, what we got here? Yeah, this is uh, a part of the sauce. And this is just a mix of... Uh, you start doing a caramel. You melt the sugar in the pan. Mm -hmm. And then you add soy sauce, marine, sake. Mm -hmm. And put some ginger and garlic in it. And you just want the sugar to melt back again, and then we're gonna put in the melted brown butter in it. Nice. So this is just gonna be some, this is not actually a sauce, it's just you're gonna drip it around. Alright, okay. bird. Some extra shit. Yeah. All right. Cool. So, it's getting done, yeah? Looks kinda good. Huh? Yeah. Just sugar. sugar. Some small pieces of sugar. So we have some browned butter here. Yeah, browned butter. You just melt the butter until it get brown. Yeah. But not too brown. Then you get not burned brown. butter. <laughs> then you get burned butter. Burned butter. We don't like That's, that. We don't like that. We don't like that. Alright. So I and Yeah. And when this is done, mm -hmm. you put the brown butter into it. Yeah. And then you have to yeah. Take the pieces away with the uh, you strain it a little strain, bit. Yeah. yeah. Strain. strain it. Cool. Alright, so are you ready? That's about it. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Right, so what we got left here? Uh, we're gonna do the cauliflower, cauliflower puree. Mm -hmm. And this is pre boiled. Nice. It's soft. Yep. And yeah, you can put all of it in. It's no problem. No. It's good. Yeah. Nice for coloring yeah. too. Just you know, take it apart a little bit. Take it yeah. apart. Wait. And we're gonna mix it with some yogurt. Mm -hmm. Yogurt. Yes. Yeah, so you have to be a little bit careful here, so it doesn't get like a soup. No, you don't want it to be soup. We're not eating soup today. Yeah. Exactly. Any? And we try. Yeah, we try it. Ho hopefully, it won't sound too bad. So you go on with this. Mm -hmm. So it's like a smooth puree. Yep. Uh, we will add some butter in it. Nice. Big chunk. And some thyme. Nice. A bit of salt. Very nice. And just squeeze a lemon. Squeeze a little bit of lemon. Lemon juice in. Delicious. Like this. <coughs> well, yeah, you, I have use to, you have to taste it. And see if the salt is good enough. Totally. Or... Always try taste your food. Yeah. Always. So we're gonna mix this, and we will get back when it's done. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah. The puree is almost done. Yeah, the puree is almost done. It, uh, we tasted it. It tastes fantastic. Yeah. I mean, you can feel all the flavor: the cauliflower, the butter, the salt, the dragoon, the thyme, the thyme and also the yogurt. I was saying. Yeah. So. But it, it's got a little bit cold, so we keep it on low, we low, keep low. It on low. Exactly, low heat. Low heat. Very low heat, and you can stir it almost. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, yeah a bit. Yeah. So, what we got here? This is, the, oh, this is the, the sauce, sauce, man. You you, yeah, you. I strain it. Yep. Delicious. And now it's just pure butter. Let me, let me give my little taste here. And mm. this is fantastic. Mm, my God. It's kind of like a. A little bit of Asian flavor, so yeah, it's kind of like a hoisin, gin, but a lighter. Gin, yeah, yeah. the ginger 
and the soy sauce is yeah, it's very delicious. It's making it very delicious. So we still waited for the chicken to be prepared. Yeah, it's uh, a couple of done, minutes left. Couple of minutes left. So we got a gift from our friends in Barcelona. We got a bottle of wine. Yeah, it's Spanish wine. It's not a Catal- mm. Catalonia wine, I don't think. Anyway, it's my friends owns this beautiful little bar in Barcelona, Carrer Avenue. 54 so go there for your drinks and for your wine especially this wine is delicious so i suggest we have a little toast a little toast cheers cheers chef and uh hope this weather gets better soon man because it's, it's super cold this is very it's a good wine yeah it's uh, kind of quite heavy I quite heavy say. i'm not sure if it's um this, I, w- I would recommend this maybe more for like uh, just to chill out or maybe steak a barbecue or, steak yeah. yeah but it's a good in the meantime wine definitely yeah totally we like wine Pruno Pruno it's from I don't know what's the region man can you read on the back uh, it's uh, like Re- 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 Riviera del Duero yeah it's also available at Sistema Laget yeah yeah for and ordering for those that doesn't know what Systembolaget is, <laughs> then you can Google it. Systembolaget yeah. yeah. in Sweden. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, let's uh, have a little wine break and just wait for the chicken, yeah? Yeah. yeah. Right, man. It's time for some plating. Yeah, yeah. let's try to plate this up. Uh, we'll try a full chicken. Yeah, we'll try a full chicken. Yeah. So, if you, if you want, you can cut it up, but well, it takes a lot of time to cut five chicken nice. up. Yeah, so, totally. You have to work with it on your own. Yeah, it's a small chicken. Yeah, it's a small. You chicken. got a knife and a fork. So improvise. We put it on a plate and mm-hmm. let's take the puree. And I will go with something like this. Yeah, that's it. Nice. Uh, also has some cauliflower that is roasted. Yes, roasted cauliflower. Nice. Let's just put some pieces in here. Yeah. Nice. And nice. Nice. Then we got the sauce. Oh, hit me with the sauce. You're gonna put it on the chicken here? Yeah? You're gonna put it like, I like it there. Yeah, a little bit. This looks nice. Yeah, don't don't overdo it. Like this. Beautiful. And if you want, you can take some crushed hazelnuts. Yeah, totally. Yes. Go for it, man. Go for it a bit. No. You can also roast the hazelnuts. A These bit. are roasted. They're roasted now. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Some greens? Uh, yeah, you can add some greens to it. Um, mm. We uh, would like to have some uh, pickled uh, endive. Yeah, but endive salad. Yeah. Uh, uh, do you have any chives? Something like that? Chives. Yeah. You got chives. Because <laughs> what I think, and also I know you think, we need some green. It's a color. It should look... It looks nicer when you put some greens on stuff. Man, let me, let me just go around. to this dish or whatever you want. Yeah, but salad is for scissors. <laughs> this looks fantastic, John. Um, can, you, can you take it up? Take it up. Yeah. Right, so we got um, culinary, uh, sorry, cauliflower puree, the yogurt, uh, lemon, uh, what else? Thyme. Thyme. And uh, with a spring chicken, spring chicken filled with apple, onions, roasted. Yeah, so it's stuffed, it's still stuffed. You have to take off the stuff in them, yeah, but you can, can also eat it. You can eat the stuff, yeah. You it's no bigger. Look want. at this guy. And we have some roasted cauliflower. You have this beautiful sauce, it's kind of like a broth sauce. Simple, yeah, it's Asian. more like a, a brown, uh, brown butter butter sauce, sauce. Yeah. with an uh, Asian touch. Nice, yeah, hazelnuts. Grab your glass. Salud, chef. This is going to be magnifico. Cheers. Cheers, man. And uh, hope we see you soon again. Yeah, I hope we see you guys soon again. Yeah. All right. Happy. Happy whatever. Yeah. Peace. Bye.